Hallo und herzlich willkommen zu einer neuen Folge von Let's Play The Walking Dead. Ich fahre gerade auf meinem Kopfhörerkabel rum. So, jetzt ist es weg. Ja, wir haben jetzt die spannende Situation und müssen uns entscheiden, wem wir jetzt hier das Essen geben. Ähm, ich fasse nochmal kurz zusammen. Da hinten die Kat Katja, die man hier jetzt gerade nicht sieht. Da, das ist unsere Ärztin. Die ist auch ein bisschen schwach und alles, aber... Die gehört halt zu Kenny. Okay. Das ist Mark. Mark ist, äh, handelt unüberlegt, wenn er, äh, nicht krank, sondern, äh, hungrig ist. Lenny ist ein totales Arschloch. Larry heißt er. Ähm, aber, äh, es wird immer aggressiver, wenn er hungrig ist. Und Lilly mag es vielleicht, wenn wir ihm was geben. Lilly, äh, ist ein bisschen garstig und so. Clementine ist auch ein bisschen hungrig. Der Ben, der ist natürlich auch ein bisschen hungrig. Alle sind ein bisschen hungrig. Aber er ist, keine Ahnung, er ist ein bisschen betrübt und alles und ein bisschen traurig, was jetzt passiert ist. Doug war bislang ein bisschen noch munter. Äh, Carly ist unsere, hat jetzt am längsten gewacht und ist auch ein bisschen betrübt und alles. Kenny ist ja, Kenny ist eigentlich noch relativ munter, ist da auch ein bisschen mh, aggro drauf, aber er, er jammert nicht so rum, dass er äh, hungrig ist. Deswegen werde ich folgendes machen. Allererstes Clementine. Hey Clem, you need something to eat. Einen halben Apfel. Sie muss gesund essen. Das ist wichtig. I love apples. Thank you. Are there more? No, honey. That was the last one. Oh. Um. Enjoy it. You deserve it. Weil wir haben ja versprochen, du hast noch dreimal was zu essen da. Wir haben versprochen, auf sie aufzupassen, und das werden wir natürlich machen. Hat sie noch irgendwas zu sagen? You'll be okay over here? Uh -huh. I'll be okay. Das ist gut. So, das zweite Ding würde ich jetzt gerne Kali geben. Weil sie halt immer gut ist und immer, äh, und immer Wachposten schiebt und uns und halt versteht. Here. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. Was? I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. Carly is ja übelst nett, Junge. Die ist ja übelst nett. Die hat gerade das Essen abgelehnt. Boah, das ist ja cool. Das ist ja cool. Die mag ich. So. Das zweite würde ich gerne hier Mark geben. Weil er ist halt unser Hunter und er muss halt schlau überlegen, was er macht. Mark. Geben. Hier. Eat something. Thanks, Lee. Wow, super. Well, good luck with that wall. We'll get it. Okay. Und das letzte, das oder nee, ich habe noch zwei, ne? Egal. Auf jeden Fall eins werde ich jetzt auf jeden Fall noch Larry geben, weil Lily ist ziemlich angepisst auch gegenüber von uns und Larry ist, ah, oh, er versaut einfach die ganze Gruppe. Er versaut die ganze Gruppe. Deswegen müssen wir ihm eigentlich etwas geben. <lacht> Here, Larry. Lily would want you to keep your strength up. That girl needs to quit worrying about me so much. Oh. 
Oh, letzte Nahrung. Behalten wir das? Oder geben wir das? Das ist eine schwere Entscheidung. Wenn ja, wem geben wir das? Oh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Und zwar möchte ich gerne es Scheiße. Das ist jetzt eine schwere Entscheidung. Kenny hat uns schon gesagt, er will uns mitnehmen, weil wir halt immer zu ihm gehalten haben. Duck ähm, ist momentan quick lebendig und meckert nicht rum und alles. Ähm, da hinten die Ärztin, die, die Katja, ist auch noch äh, ja ein bisschen hungrig, aber es geht. Aber die hier ist mega angepisst, deswegen will ich ihr das lieber geben. I don't want anything from you. Take it anyway. You need to eat. This doesn't change anything. Well, that's it. Not such an easy job, is it? I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. So, me and my family don't matter to you anymore? No. It's not like that. Don't make me regret asking you to come along on the RV. Ich wusste es. Ich wusste Ken, es. Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Katja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Oh. What? Oh, victim it! What? What? Weg mit dir, weg mit dir. Hilfe, Hilfe, Hilfe. Oh mein Gott, Junge. Weg mit dir. Weg mit dir. Weg mit dir. Ich hab gesagt, weg mit dir. Mmh, lecker. Lecker. You okay? Yeah. Thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! You said he wasn't bitten! What? We asked you point blank, was he bitten, and you said no! He wasn't! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What?! Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. Thus? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. We're all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know, I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax! Me and my brother, yes, we, we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. You're outnumbered here. Just turn around and go back. 
Okay, that's fine. Uh, but but you'd really be helping out a fellow survivor if you could part with some extra gas before we leave. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road, and if y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. It's couldn't fall a zone. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit? I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Oh. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Es könnte eine gute Chance sein, aber es könnte auch eine riesen Falle sein. Uh, es kann momentan einfach fast nicht mehr schlimmer gehen, also gehen wir einfach mal zum Mölker rein. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So, this dairy. Hoffentlich war es die richtige Entscheidung. Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. You think they'd want me for later? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well. Not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Yeah, but it's on. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore. Asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Aww. Where are you from? Uh... The motor end's my home now, I guess. Hmm. Well, that place seen better days, huh? You can say that again. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor end. Uh, who's running things over there? We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. Uh, but... In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, they and you guys were keeping it there's up. There's only two of them. Oh no, there's yeah, a lot more. Yeah, you know what? We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! <laughs> Was? Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you! Jesus! Asshole! world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Was? Ich hab hier alles erwartet, aber das nicht. Wow. Okay. Äh, gefressen oder gefressen werden, ne? 
Ne, fressen oder gefressen werden heißt das. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Wieso ist eigentlich der Kleine mit dabei? Der Ben? Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's been living down at the old motel, round the way. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you oh got my goodness. someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Bored. Can't get stuff oh, like God. that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. Oder, oder that's Käse right. Oder Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. You sick Ben bitch to help. <laughs> Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Hm, sagen wir dafür, dass es hier sicher ist, oder wir sollten ihnen helfen, so gut es geht. Ich würde sagen, wir sorgen dafür, dass es sicher ist. Oder, ah, dann, dann werfen die uns raus. Ah, ansonsten werden wir überrannt. Ah, wir sorgen lieber dafür, dass es sicher ist. Wir können denken, dass wir unsere ganze Gruppe hier stehen müssen. Wir müssen herausfinden, ob dieses Ort so sicher ist, wie sie uns sagen. Richtig, natürlich denken sie, dass es sicher ist. Aber ist es sicher genug für die Kinder? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Okay. So sieht der äh, Hof ja eigentlich ganz schlecht aus. Muss ich ja mal sagen. Hier gibt's Kühe, hier gibt's äh, Getreide, ein Zaun mit Strom und alles. Nur halt das Benzin, ne? Benzin ist dann auch nicht wieder so schön, weil es uns dann auch wieder ausgeht irgendwie. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. Hmm, okay. Wonder how much food they've got in there. Hopefully we'll find out. Ja. Hoffentlich genügend, weil wir sind ja wieder neun Leute oder so. Wie sieht's hier aus? Okay, 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 sonst nichts. 
Nö. Ja, das Getreide ist immer doof. Da können die Zombies rauskommen. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Yeah. Finde ich eine gute Idee. So machen wir die Kinder glücklich und helfen nach der Familie etwas. So machen wir eigentlich alle glücklich. Benutzen Götter. Ah, will ich jetzt momentan noch nicht. Plattenzaun. Das ist nicht schlecht. Generator. What's that? Generator. You guys come along with gas just in time. Hey, uh, don't mess with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. Okay. Was ist das? Benutzen Gatter. Wie soll ich das benutzen? Mm, ein Brett. Eine Säge. Wahnsinn, ele elektrischer Zaun. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Und sobald die Leuchter... Ja. Sobald die Leuchter ausgeht, ist er nicht mehr unter Strom und somit sind wir nahezu ungeschützt. Oh, da ist ja eine Säge. Oh mein Gott. Hm. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. Sehr gut. Perfekt. Jawohl, eben in die Hosentasche. Dann mal eben fixen. Dann gehen wir hier mal aus dem Gatter. Dann gehen wir da gleich mal in den Gatter. Mir fehlt noch das Seil. Vorher bekomme ich denn jetzt ein Seil. Ah. Da oben vielleicht? Ich benutze hier einfach mal das Gatter. Hey, uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn? How secure is your barn? Having a safe place for the cow is pretty important. Thanks to the fence, nothing gets in here anymore. Unfortunately, the daddies took most of our cattle before we got it running. Mind if I take a look? Sure, but uh, why don't we do that after we tend to the perimeter? Sounds good. Hmm. Ach so, so ist es also. Wir sollen also erstmal den Zaun reparieren. Und dann... Darf ich vielleicht zur Kuh gehen? Verdächtig, verdächtig. Wir sollen erst der Familie helfen, sodass alles sicher ist. Und dann dürfen wir erst zur Kuh gehen. Ah, da könnte vielleicht irgendwas mit der Kuh sein. Sie ist krank. Also, ich weiß es ja noch nicht, ne? Aber ich würde einfach mal sagen, es hier für die Folge erstmal Schluss. Wir sehen uns beim nächsten Mal. Haut rein. Ciao.